Welcome to our journey back in time, to the year 1904. Today we're revisiting a historic game of American football between the University of Michigan Wolverines and the University of Chicago Maroons. As we set the stage, the Wolverines were undefeated, their spirits high and their determination unyielding. On the other side, the Maroons' record was marred by a single tie. The rivalry between the two teams was intense, fueled by the competitive spirit of their coaches. Michigan's coach, Fielding Yost, had defeated Chicago's coach, Amos Alonzo Stagg, in each of his first three years igniting a long and bitter rivalry. Leading the point-a-minute Wolverines was the All-American halfback, Willie Heston. The Maroons, on the other hand, were led by their skilled quarterback, Walter Eckersall. Ferry Field was packed with 13,500 spectators, all eagerly awaiting the start of the game. The film opens with Michigan on defense, the tension palpable. The game kicks off with a Michigan kickoff and a run from scrimmage, possibly by Tom Hammond. The sideline footage shows close-ups of a number of Michigan players, including Walter Ochte, Graham, and Adolf Germany. Schulz. Also caught on camera is Keen Fitzpatrick, the football trainer and track coach, watching the game with a keen eye. As the game concludes, the camera pans slowly over the crowd, the press box, and the bleachers, capturing the intense emotions of the spectators. This game, a testament to the spirit of American football, remains etched in history. Thank you for joining us on this journey back in time. Stay tuned for more exciting historical narratives.